This chapter will include the square knot version 1 and version 2 and a short section on tips for getting started that will extend the life of your straps. Before you begin, one thing you need to check before you strap up your cymbals is your grommets. These come from the factory in the center of the cymbal to give the straps a smooth surface to glide on which will make the straps last longer. If your cymbals are missing their grommets, you can purchase a grommet kit at most hardware stores and replace your own or for a quick fix you can use stick tape or electrical tape to smooth out the inner surface a bit to help protect your straps or bandanas. There are many ways to initially set up your straps for using the Garfield grip. The version I explain here is the one that I prefer because it will ensure that the straps curl out where they meet between your thumb and index finger so you have a more comfortable fit. For this version, you will hold the strap in front of you with the Zildjian logo facing you. Pinch the split ends of the strap together so that the smooth finish sides are against each other. Bring your thumbs together, folding the strap down so the two ends are now together and the Zildjian logo is facing away from you. This will ensure the strap flattens out more evenly across the hand without binding. Now, take your strap and put it through the pad, through the center of the symbol, flip your symbol over and spread the strap out so you will be ready to tie your square knot. Spread the straps out to form an X. Take two opposing straps and fold them down loosely without creasing the leather. Take the other two straps and cross them over a free end then under the folded end. This will give you a square knot. Tighten the straps evenly to prevent the strap from binding. Spread the straps out to form an X. Take one strap and lay it over the strap beside it. Take that strap and lay it over the next strap. Take the strap that you have just crossed and cross it over the next strap. Take the last strap and cross it over the strap you just laid down and then tuck it under the first strap. Tighten the straps evenly to prevent the strap from binding. If you have problems with the straps pulling through the symbol, try placing a penny in the center of the square knot to help hold it in place or you can use my favorite technique of putting two strap ends through the center of a small washer then tie the knot with the other two ends going around the washer. The pad is an optional item. I prefer to use them but if you decide to go without pads make sure you wear gloves to protect yourself from getting the webbing between your thumb and pointer finger ripped as it sometimes gets snagged between the straps and the grommets at the center of the symbol. <laughs> 